In this video, we're going to take a look at how we use BlueJ to create classes, and we'll motivate it with figure 1-5 from page 11. First thing we see is that there's a Beetle game class. Now, BlueJ provides a bunch of code by default. You can look at it later, but for purposes of most things in this class, we won't need it, so you can erase it. When you erase it, you should see that you can compile it without error. By clicking New Class, you create a new class in BlueJ. Here's the Beetle class, and once again, I'm going to get rid of all the code that's inside of it. I make sure that there are a matching pair of brackets and nothing else in the class. Create one last class, which is the Die class. Not Dire, but Die. And so, finally, we go ahead and get rid of the code that is provided by default. Hit Compile, and the final step is we can tell BlueJ to put in some relationships between those classes, which reflect what we see in the book. We compile everything, and we should find that everything compiles great, and we're ready to continue on.